Well, it's Christmas Day, and that marks the first football practice for the Iowa Hawkeyes down here in Tampa, Florida. The Christmas spirit was everywhere today, but also just the football spirit, as this is Iowa's first practice outdoors in over a month. Oh, man, it felt great. You know, you see this, this blue sky, sunshine. It felt great. It was a little tough, you know, in the beginning of the warm-ups. I'm like, oh, man, we're making some heat now, you know, when you're in the facility and it's, you know, maybe 40, 30 degrees in there. But, uh, you know, it was, it was a good practice today, and we got a lot accomplished. You know, but we still we got a lot of work to do to, to be able to be at LSU because they're a great team. Yeah, I was thinking about that today, actually, and it wasn't that cold uh, our last game. Uh, the week before was a little bit chillier, certainly, but uh, uh, today, you know, probably about a 70-degree swing from uh, when we left Iowa City yesterday morning. So it's, it's always an experience. That's one reason we like to get down a day or two early and just get the guys acclimated. But uh, I think they moved around and hustled, and uh, hopefully we'll look a little bit better as we move along. Uh, it, it was good, you know, it was a lot of heat, so we got to battle through it, but uh, overall I think we did a good job, uh, you know, tomorrow going to be another step forward, uh, you know, it's definitely different from going from 2 degrees to uh, 80 degrees or, or 60 or whatever it is higher, so uh, it, it was a good step and we just got to uh, come back tomorrow and get better. Like many people, Coach Ferentz has his own holiday tradition. Every Christmas you'll see him at practice in preparation for the bowl wearing his Santa hat. I think we had it for the first Alamo Bowl in uh, 2001. I can't remember how we got it, how we stumbled into it, but uh, Terry Armstrong's done a great job of keeping the tradition alive, and she even dry cleaned it this year, So, uh, and it's well rested, unfortunately. Didn't get, didn't get to use it last year. I, I think they get a kick out of it, and uh, you know, ho, ho, ho. So, uh, but it, it is a work day, and that's one thing you know, we try to explain to our players. If, if you're a college football player or a college coach, uh, it, it's really not good to be sitting home on Christmas, and it's just uh, it's a little bit different, but uh, for the players, it's really a small window of their lives and uh, you know they still get to call home and hopefully uh, touch touch base with their families but uh, it is different certainly and uh, I just want to lighten it up a little bit. Uh, I'm Anthony Hitchens, I'm from uh, Lorraine, Ohio and Merry Christmas to all the Hawkeyes. Carl Davis from Detroit, Michigan. Happy holidays everybody. See you January 1st. Bobby Kennedy, coach wide receivers. I live in Coralville, Iowa. Just wanted to wish a happy holidays to uh, all the Hawk faithful. Uh, looking forward to seeing you down here in beautiful Tampa. It's a great day down here, and uh, we're gonna celebrate tonight with a little holiday meal, and uh, look forward to seeing you. I'm Josie Jewell, I'm from Decorah, Iowa. I wish you a happy holidays from Tampa Bay. Cavante Martin Manley, Pontiac, Michigan. Just wanna say happy holidays, be safe, and have fun. I'm Tanner Miller, I'm from Cologne, Iowa, and we're down here in Tampa, Florida, and we're just wishing everybody back in Iowa a Merry Christmas. Uh, BJ Lowry, Cincinnati, Ohio, DB. I just want to say Merry Christmas to everybody, everybody back home in Cincinnati, Ohio. Let's go Hawks. A little shrink of Passat from Chicago, Illinois. I just want to say a Merry Christmas to all the Hawkeye fans out there and uh, everybody that's going to be watching. Thanks. I'm Desmond King from Detroit, Michigan. Happy holidays from the Hawkeye family. Jordan Cotton from Mount Pleasant, Iowa. And I just want to wish every, every Hawk fan a, a Merry Christmas and a Happy Holidays. I'm Ray Hamilton, um, tight end, junior from Strongsville, Ohio. I just wanted to say Happy Holidays to everyone out there. Uh, wish you a safe Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Go Hawks! Dominic Alves from Logan, Iowa, and I want to give a Happy Holidays to all our troops and to uh, everybody you can't be with the loved ones this Christmas. I'm Austin Blythe. I'm from Williamsburg, Iowa, and I just want to wish a Merry Christmas to my friends and family back home. Be sure to check back in with us on Thursday as we have an exclusive interview with former Hawkeye and current Tampa Bay Buccaneer defensive end Adrian Claiborne. In Tampa, this is Nick Dorman for HawkeyeSports.com.